He was quick to respond to that tweet from the president saying he did nothing out of his job description, but state Republicans want him to prove that under oath. Senator Murphy says that over the weekend he met with Iran's foreign minister Mohammed Havad Zarif in Germany. The president claims Murphy broke the Logan Act, a law signed in 1799 that criminalizes negotiations by unauthorized citizens with foreign governments in a dispute with the U.S. The intent of the act is to prevent someone from undermining the government's position. Murphy tweeted at the president saying he is the ranking member of the Senate Foreign Relations Subcommittee on the Middle East. He then said, quote, it's literally my job to meet with regional leaders. The president and secretary of state Mike Pompeo, Pompeo said they were not aware of the meeting. Some Republicans are calling it a secret meeting. State chairman of the Republican Party, J.R. Romano, says people deserve to know what really happened. Um, when you're talking about Iran, this isn't just, hey, you ran into someone. I mean, this was arranged well in advance. Um, and frankly, Chris Murphy should answer those questions. Everyone should testify in front of Congress. What was the conversation? What were the communications leading up to the meeting? Were there emails? Were there text messages? Were there phone calls? How was this arranged? Those questions need to be answered. Now, Murphy says he wasn't negotiating with, with Zarif or, or passing any government legislation or anything along those lines or trying to undermine anything. He just says that he was trying to have a dialogue, which he says is something that's important to do. In Southington, Dave Puglisi, Fox 61 News.